the, the voice is our literally vessel for communication and after all, I'm a born communicator and aren't we all? If we can't communicate, we are, can't ask for what we need. Can't get fed when you're a baby, you know, you can't say help if you're trapped behind somewhere. The voice is your literally your way of communicating. As I say, we also have non-verbal ways. We have, uh, you know, um, physical ways of communicating by our face, by our body. That's a whole other ball game. But today we're focusing, uh, um, and my strength, I suppose, is using my voice. To many people, communication means the words they say and hear or read and write. Others would suggest that the body language and facial expressions that we use are key in the way that we communicate. How about the way that we communicate through music and performance? In this video, I will look at how we communicate with one another and the variety of means that we use to do so. My name is Hedges Akram. I'm the principal of the Hampstead Academy of Acting and Drama and also the director of Shout at Cancer. It's not about how you sound, it's about how your body actually resonates. We communicate. It's your facial expressions. Often, we think, oh yeah, what I'm about to say is really important, but it's all about the body about the facial expressions that often give away what we're about to say anyway. We use acting, singing, vocal techniques and physical theatre to make the body alive, to make that individual alive, that they realise that actually they're more than just a, a, a voice. We want to empower them to say what it is that they want to say, not have to apologise for it and have that, that quality behind the whole body language, the words that they're using and the impact. The voice is almost incidental. You don't actually often think when you speak. When you speak, it comes naturally. Shakespeare said life is a stage, and on the stage we are all actors. And life is just like that. My motto is don't think, just do. Don't think, just be. Communication is the way that we interact with each other and the world. It's an integral part of all of our lives, and in the modern day, we are able to stay connected and communicate with one another all of the time. It's clear that this means different things to different people, but the art of communication is how you can voice your thoughts and feelings, sometimes without even having an actual voice.